Hello friends, it's your bronies. Welcome back. Energy drink review time again today. I was very sporadic last week. Listen, this time of year, my schedule is chaos because the kids are out of school. We've got a lot of people in the cage during the day. We've got the jabroni crew. We're trying to make youth baseball fun again today. Youth live at bats. Uh, youth 10 run challenge. Bat flips. Double, triple celebrations. If you like baseball and you want young people to like baseball, this is the thing for you. I was in Knoxville all weekend at the Tennessee Regional. Again, if you like baseball and you are entertained by baseball, the Tennessee Volunteers are the funnest team that I have ever watched in all my years of watching. I am fully aware that most people would disagree with me on that. Baseball purists, there's not baseball purists watching me anyway. Why would a baseball purist watch the guy with long hair that likes tanks and throwing gas and bat flips and fun baseball? Why would he watch the energy review? He wouldn't. So I don't even care what they think. Baseball fun, yes or no? Yes. If you're making the – listen, that that ball team has we, – we play the walk-up songs here in the cage. They have done so much for my kids in liking baseball. My daughter played this weekend. I said, hey, if you hit a double or you hit a triple, uh, you got to do a double celebration like the Vols. She gets to third. She, we've been doing it in the cage. She works on the Doctor Strange. If you didn't see the Doctor Strange with my daughter, it's on Twitter. Enough of that. We got G Fuel Snow Cone. This is a real flavor, Rusty Callum. No deductions for having a fake flavor. 1 through 10, can't say 7 is the latest score. This is a good drink. This is one of my, I think this is my favorite G Fuel drink. Little blueberry, got a little bit of the goat in it. My wife and I like to say that. Got a hint of the goat in it. It does have a hint of the goat in it. That's a fact. The White Monster, 10 out of 10. If you've never drank the White Monster, you were missing out. I think I saw a white monster in a regional game. I think I saw James Ramsey. My boy James Ramsey at Georgia Tech. Who knows the Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets? James Ramsey, Nick Askew. Nick was my played for me in high school. He is a director of player development down there. James Ramsey, a good friend. Uh, that Georgia Tech team offense is very, very good. I've seen a few games at Lindsey Nelson Stadium this year. That Georgia Tech offense was as better than everybody's that I've seen. Kudos to them. Keep it going, boys. I told them that. Hopefully, we'll get them back on the podcast. If you haven't seen the podcast, link below. Apple, Spotify, my name, summertime, college coaches are getting out. I'm going to hit a bunch of college coach interviews, podcast interviews uh, this summer that we'll be releasing through the summer uh, into the fall. Be sure to like and subscribe to the podcast if you haven't already. Like and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Help this thing grow. The greatest energy drink reviewer, BP Thrower. Uh, playlist song hype man ever. That's me. 1 through 10, can't say 7. 7 is a lazy score. Don't be lazy. I'm giving this 8.6. G Fuel, snow cone, sod can, good drink, G Fuel. Hopefully, I'll be able to knock these out because my schedule is insane. Wednesday, we got live ABs in East Tennessee. If you want some of that smoke in East Tennessee, you want to come throw to our hitters, come get you some. I dare you. You probably won't, though, because cheaters like T Work and Grind, post on Instagram, Grind. They don't want none of that. They don't want none of that live smoke in the cage. Might make you look bad, but in turn, it might make you better if you see it a lot. That's all I got for today. Have a great day. Throw gas, punch tickets, hit homers. Love baseball and softball, college world series. Having a hard time with the softball, college world series. Can't tell you why, but for those of my friends, you'll know why. Anyway, have a great day. I will see you back tomorrow, hopefully.